CAD CAM waxing sleeves were specially designed for our inclusive titanium implant abutment and are compatible with implants from the following manufacturers. Biomet 3i, CAMLOG, Dense Ply Implants, Prismatic Dental Craft, Noble BioCare, Strawman, and Zimmer Dental. Use the CAD CAM waxing sleeve when outsourcing your milled titanium abutment to us. Simply add wax to the waxing sleeve to design your desired abutment shape. They include the required lab screws. These waxing sleeves have been designed specifically for designing CAD CAM custom abutments and should not be used with a lost wax technique. To begin your abutment wax up design session, first select the appropriate inclusive plastic waxing sleeve for the implant type and size required. Once the waxing sleeve has been removed from the package, insert the screw through the top of the sleeve so that the threaded end is emerging through the connection to the implant. Place the waxing sleeve onto the implant analog in the soft tissue model, taking special care to ensure that the sleeve and analog are completely engaged. Once you are certain that the two pieces are fully engaged, use the appropriate screwdriver to tighten the abutment screw. The waxing sleeve must be fastened securely, but take care not to over tighten the screw as this may cause the plastic to deform and make it more difficult to remove the screw later. Next, use your low speed handpiece to reduce the waxing sleeve to the appropriate height. Once you are satisfied with the height of your abutment, use your high-speed handpiece to refine and shape the plastic sleeve to your liking. Before applying wax, make sure to remove all plastic debris from the sleeve. First, apply a band of wax to the free gingival margin around the abutment. Once the wax is cooled, loosen the screw and remove the waxing sleeve from the model. The wax band will clearly identify the gingival margin and provide visible feedback about the depth of tissue at the abutment site. Using a different color of wax, begin designing the subgingival portion of the abutment. This will help you visibly identify the transition from the tissue and highlight the crown margin line later. Continue adding wax to the wax sleeve until you've achieved your desired abutment contour and emergence profile. Next, use the instrument of your choice to shape the wax as required. When you are satisfied with the wax shape of the base of the abutment, try it back on the soft tissue model. Once again, take care to ensure that the waxing sleeve and the implant analog are completely engaged and fastened securely with the screw. Before continuing on to waxing the top cap, Make sure that you are satisfied with the fit of your abutment shape into the soft tissue opening. This may require a few additional adjustments. You are now ready to begin waxing the top cap. Apply wax as required to get the appropriate shape of the tooth that you are replacing. With the waxed abutment still in place on the model, begin removing wax and shaping your top cap as required. You will note that, by using the colored wax earlier, you will have a clearly visible marker as to where the tissue transition is as you remove wax around the margin area. Additional visibility can be achieved by using black marker to clearly highlight the margin line. 
Once you are satisfied with the design of the abutment, it is ready for scanning with your preferred CAD system.